Okay, so there are many ways to set up a website, right? So which one would you prefer? Which one would you recommend us to choose for setting the website? Okay, so for now we got three ways to set up a website like the free platform, the QNAP NAS mm -hmm. and one cloud server. Yes. I think for the beginner they will use the free platform because they are not famili familiar with the uh, blogger to um they are not familiar that. with blogging and how to set up a website. Maybe they will just practice and destroy and build and destroy and build, but uh, not uh, actually provide any quality content in the web, right? Yeah. With an online free platform. And if you choose to use the uh, QNAP NAS, I think the most benefit is our file management software. And we uh, support a very high security mm. because we are the CV E numbering authority. So if there have any security issue, we will be know and uh, quick quickly fix it. Yeah. So we, we support you in everything. So the NAS supports every every step that you have because it has the high security maintenance. And the cost of use QNAP NAS is fixed because if you use cloud server, the charge may be. Uh, Increase by your space requirement like yeah, that. Yeah, traffic and they, yeah. they will keep charging you more and more. The more you grow, the more the more that they will charge you. But with the cost with our NAS, it's, you will have only the uh, hardware cost, right? Yeah. So let's do the next one. The oh, this one. Yeah. <laughs> so let's recap today's topic. So it is flexible. Yeah. Because we are able to expand software and hardware at any time. Yes. By that, it means that uh, you can use uh, WordPress and use all the services of our QNAP NAS and our QTS uh, apps to integrate in the, how to say, you utilize WordPress in a better way, right? Yes. And uh, it, you have more control on it. So it, uh, by control, but uh, co having more control is that you have your own website, you own everything in your NAS. And then uh, you control the host, you control the domain, and uh, even uh, uh, when we go to the third part is the security. So we provide the CVE numbering authority. And if, since it is a NAS, it has to provide you the backup solution. Right. Because our QNAP NAS and are famous for, for backup and yes. for, for securing the, your data, uh, not to be able to lose them. And uh, the last part is uh, being efficient. So by being efficient, it supports full text search, as you mentioned earlier, with QSearch, right? Yeah. And multimedia editing tools. So we have uh, plenty of multimedia editing tools. And uh, for example, with QFiling, you can do the video transcoding. Yes. You can do the watermark and other, other documents that you can do. Yeah. So I think this is a, these are very powerful for uh, reasons and benefits of using the WordPress in QNAP NAS, right? Yeah. So I think uh, we, we, we covered a lot of topics, so we had two demos. So I will just uh, say that uh, in, a short, in a shorter recap, I will just try to say what we covered for today, but let's go first to the live.